Welcome back to day six of Boldest Fit, fitting farewell to 2020. Are you ready to kickstart your workout today? We have our three usual circuits, ready, steady and explode. Let's start with ready. That's 30 seconds work, 30 seconds break, five rounds. Your first workout will be explained by coach Mogambo. All right, so it's gonna be, uh, the first exercise is quad and twist. So, then the second one's a superman hold. The third one's a strider. The fourth one's a hand release push up. We're gonna start off three, two, one, and go. So we've got 30 seconds of squat and twist, uh, working on obliques, working on the lower body strength. We've got a lot of uh, lower body stuff coming in with a mix of upper body as well. So with the hand release push up, we do a lot of upper body. Strider works a lot on uh, core. Superman holds again will work on mid back and your back and the squat and twist will work on your obliques and legs and break. 30 seconds of break. And go! All the way up, make sure you squeeze your glutes, contract your upper back, chest is off the floor. Just keep try pushing it up, keep contracting your spine, the muscles around your spine which is your uh, lower back, mid back and your scapula muscles. Keep looking forward, make sure your chest is not in contact with the floor and break. That's exercise number two. Moving on to number three, we've called it striders. And let's go. Yeah, you could do it like this or if you want to go all out, you could do it that way. 10 seconds up, we've got 20 more seconds to go. Keep it going. Basically, this also works as a hip opener. so. If you guys have mobility issues on your hip and break, so you probably want to try this more often. Uh, a very good warm up also, especially for uh, athletes or runners who probably want to warm up before they run or activity. Good way to open your hips up. And moving on to hand release push up in 3, 2, 1 and go. Go on all the way. Lift your palms out and push the ground away from you from the base of your palm. Focus on the base of the palm. Your chest, hip, knee and shoulder move together in one line. Do not lift your chest up and leaving behind your hip and knee because it becomes a back extension, we don't want that. And break. Alright, that's the end of round number one. We will move on to round number two. In three, two, one, and let's go. Squat and twist coming up for round number two. 
Chris is flaunting off uh, last season's RCB uh, cap. This would have looked better with that purple shorts of yours. And break. Moving on to Superman holds and let's go in 3, 2, 1 and Superman it is. Up, up, up. If you want to get better with this exercise guys, uh, you probably want to wear your uh, underwear above your shorts. This helps. You get better. <laughs> chest up, chest up. 10 more seconds to go. And break. And the third one's a strider. We'll start off in three, two, one, and go. Keep it going. This is round number two. We've got three more rounds coming after this. Just keep moving on with the reps, we guys. We do not want you guys to stop. The exercises are pretty doable. Pretty much uh, using your own body weight as resistance. You don't need weights. You do not need anything but just some amount of commitment. And break. Last one coming up in the form of hand release push up in 3, 2, 1 and go. Focus on pushing from the base of your palm. That's the whole idea of a push up is that you utilize the base of your palm as your main point of contact with the ground to push your body off the ground. Breathe in and explore out of the ground. Breathe in and explore out of the ground. We've got three more seconds to go. And round two, that is. Moving on to round number three. Midway into the first round, we've got uh, a great steady round coming up, working on the core and we've got explode to burn out those leftover calories for today. But before that, we gotta finish the round ready. Round number three, coming up in three, two, one, and go. Squat and twist. We've got five more seconds for this round to get done with. Sorry, this exercise to get done with and we move on to Superman holds and break.
And moving on to exercise number two, it's Superman holds in three, two, one, and go. Let's go. Hold it up. Pinch your scabs. Lift your chest off the floor. Push your hips into the ground. Legs go up in the air. Knee no contact with the floor. No contact with the floor from the palms as well. Face looking straight up. The whole idea is to breathe in and breathe out with a good amount of tempo. So probably you should take three to four seconds to breathe in, three to four seconds to breathe out and hold it there. And that's the end of the exercise. We move on to the next one, which is the strider. We probably want Fan Boss to do the plyo strider for 10 seconds and for the rest 20 seconds, he could stride it up in a regular way. And we'll start off in three, two, one, and go. That's Plyo Striders for everybody who wants to attempt this along with Phantom Boss. And after 10 seconds, we will go back to the basic strider and you can change if you want to, one step at a time. Make sure you open your hips out, chest looking forward, stretch a bit. We've got five more seconds of strider left in the round and break. We will move on to hand release push up. In uh, the whole rule about the hand release push up is that you make sure your hip is stable along with your scap and moves in one line with the whole core being the bridge in between. Alright, we're gonna start off in 3, 2, 1 and go! And release push up for round number 3. Base of the palm, scap and hips. Stabilize by the core, so activate a lot of your core guys. Make sure you are pushing off from the base of your palm. Do not push from your knee. Do not extend your lower back. Hips and scapula moves in together. Three more seconds to go and break. At the end of round number three, we will move on to round number four. This is the time you probably want to go get some water quickly because uh, We've got two more rounds coming up for ready and then we move to steady, keep hydrating. You should start feeling your joints open up, your body getting more warmer and feeling the reps going easy. So now we're gonna push the tempo up a little. So the whole the whole of the next round we'll probably wanna do as many reps as we can without stopping in between. Three, two, and let's go. Squat and tail. Squat and twist it guys. Squat and twist. Good amount of uh, leg work in this round, good amount of core work in this round, good amount of upper body work also in the form of uh, superman holds and, uh, and release push ups. And break. First exercise done of round number four. Now we move on to Superman holds, which is the most toughest movement of the entire four exercise that I feel it is. The holds are always tough, never easy. The holds always test your breathing, it tests your strength. And let's go. Time's up, time's up, and up. Keep it going, keep it going.
and break. That's the end of the hold and we move on to strider now. We will do 15 seconds of plyo striders and 15 seconds of regular striders. Let's see how it goes and how we would test Phantom Boss into this round. Alright? And three, two, one, and go. You finished eight seconds of plyo. It's a good way to up your heart rate, guys. It's a great way to and change if you want to. A regular strider. If you if you are struggling on to doing a strider, just stay in the plank. It's all right. Get your break if you pasted the first 15 seconds with the plyo striders and that's break. The last bit coming up for round number 4 with hand release push up. If you are struggling to, with uh, the reps of hand release push-ups, I would suggest you guys to keep your knees down and do the same as you would for a regular push-up. And we'll start off in 3, 2, 1 and go. Right, show some uh, scaled down version. Yeah, see that's the one on the knee where what you could do is just leave your knee on the floor and you just do a regular push up. Let's do uh, scale down this round so that uh, everybody along with you also does the scale down version because I'm sure everybody's tried doing the, the speed striders and break. And that's the end of fourth round. Guys, you will for sure need water. Look at Phantom Boss, he's resting and breathing. Why don't you also catch up on the breath? Do not ignore your breathing, guys. Do not just head into something uh, and distract yourself. Hydrate, breathe, hydrate, breathe and recover for the next round. Very important to breathe, very important to hydrate. Especially when the rounds are on uh, metabolic conditioning. Breathing is the key. Alright, we start off with the last round for ready. Three, two and go. Squat and twist. So while you squat, the weight needs to be on the base of your heel and push the floor away from you just the way we probably do for push-ups. Apply the same uh, principles of pushing the ground away from you. 10 more seconds to go. And break. That's exercise number one for last round done. Moving on to Superman holds. In five, four, three, two, and go. Pull it up, pull it up, breathe. Breathe, focus on breathing, guys. Tempo your breathing in such a way that you at least take three to four seconds of inhale, inhaling and pause for a second and you take three to four seconds of exhaling. Usually it's supposed to be eight seconds of inhale but we'll probably in the beginning just stick to three to four seconds while we get better with that. And break. Let's move on to round number five, exercise third, that is strider. We'll start off in three, two, one, and go. 
we're going to do plyo for 15 seconds and then we will move on to doing the regular rep for another 15 seconds if phantom boss wants to go on for entire 15 seconds of plyo he can but he uh, he chooses to uh, bring the reps down as far as you are moving it's all right guys because the whole objective of this program is that to get you to move get you to exercise get you to breathe well and break Last bit of round number 1 last bit of ready coming up in 3 2 1 and go Post this we will move on to steady which is a 45 seconds on 15 seconds off round it's going to emphasize a lot on core that's the usual structure of this series that the steady round is only to work on the core You've got 10 more seconds last 10 seconds coming up and then we go for a 1 minute break come back all recover hydrated and that's the end that's the end of ready and he's spreading uh, the virus through his kisses All right, welcome back to round number 2 which we call steady. It's all about the core and steady is coach Mogambo's forte. 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of break, five rounds coming up. The first workout is the dead box. I want you to lie down on your back, bend your knees, opposite hands and opposite legs move in and move out. While you lift your arms all the way out, the opposite leg gets completely extended. We do this for 45 seconds. Once you're done with that, you have lying down torso rotation similar to the mummy sit ups i want you to sit up straight your legs extended now rotate your torso left side to right side whichever way you like it for 45 seconds and 15 seconds break once you're done with that we move on to the third routine which is the v hold and now get into that v hold or a boat hold position for 45 seconds are you good to go let's go Dead box for 45 seconds coming right up. Coach Mogambo loves his core routine. He is very honest with his workouts. Like I keep emphasizing, 45 seconds seem effortless. I think we should make it into 45 minutes because he is all about the core. That's why we call him Mogambo Hardcore. Let's go, buddy. 20 seconds up. 25 more to go. Keep breathing. I want each and every one of you to breathe. Guys please do not eat anything heavy before you start the workout because it's going to be really really difficult for you to keep up. Keep going 10 more seconds. 5 4 3 two, and break. in second breather next we have lying down torso rotations in 45 seconds are you ready and go that's it guys uh you all possessed you are possessed by the spirit of the phantom boss so please do justice to your workouts what are those little stains that are there on your t-shirt huh is are those maxi stains 
keep going guys each and every one of you i'm sorry i might be looking a little darker today it's because i had gone for holiday came back this is my tan coach mugama has nothing to say cuz he knows he's going to suffer today score routine i applied tan 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 king 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 did anyone understand that let's go buddy apply all that energy to your workouts talk less work more am i right correct cousin bhai yeah and break Fifteen second breather. Now you have a forty-five second V hold. Do not go to sleep. Wake up. Let's start in five, four, three, two, one. That's V hold to finish. Steady round number one for forty-five seconds. If you cannot do the extended hold, you can always bend your knees down. Or if that's too difficult, you can ground your knees down and get into a brace hold position. Chest. Opened out. Look straight. Breathe in. Breathe out. All right, Mokambo. You have 25 more seconds to go, buddy. How are you feeling? Tired. tired. He's always tired. He's aging. You know, funny. I see kids his age, full of energy, but somehow, Coach Mokambo has lost his aim this year. Let's go. 10 more seconds. Wow, Mokambo. 35 seconds. That's a medical miracle for you to hang on for this long. Four, three. Two and that's it. Miracle gone. Fifteen more second breather. We go on to round number two of Harry. Buddy, the whole nation is watching you. Let's go. Come on, make the nation proud. Started seven seconds back. That's it. Nice and easy. Coach Mugambo has got an injured shoulder, so please forgive him if he keeps rubbing his shoulders. He is not making excuses; he's actually injured. Uh, it's a great uh, athletic injury. You can uh, message him and find out how it happened. Let's go. 20 more, 20 more seconds to go. <laughs> Seriously, please, guys, message him on his Insta handle. Ask him how the injury happened. 10 more seconds. Now he's choking himself. In five, four. Three, two, and break. Lying down, torso rotations coming up in ten seconds. If you don't know his Insta handle, it's Coach underscore Mogambo at Instagram or how you call it. Go there, ask him, Mogambo sir, how did your shoulder injury happen? What sport were you playing? And go. That's it. Keep going, buddy. 10 seconds up 35 more to go i hope each and every one of you are following this at home this is fairly easy i i want each and every one of you to try this version it's okay if you can't keep your legs completely extended you can keep it bent as well if you can't do a full circle you can do a half circle which equally works that's it that's it all right keep going 30 seconds up 14 more seconds to go Keep going boys and girls children of all ages In 5 4 3 2 and break Last workout for round number 2 of steady is a we hold coming up in 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 and go Hold it, buddy. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. That's the way to do it. Make sure to keep yourself hydrated. I cannot keep emphasizing on it. It is key. It is vital. I hope and I pray each and every one of you are staying hydrated. You know the the funny thing about this time of the month or the year is that we do not get as thirsty as we do when during the summers. But that doesn't mean your body doesn't require that water. So please, please keep drinking water. Let's go, buddy. Ten more seconds remaining. Come on, let's fight it out. In five, four, three, two, one, break. That's the end of round number two of steady.
All right, guys, welcome back to round three of Steady. 45 seconds worth, 15 seconds break. Coming right up is Dead Box in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, Mogambo. He's all charged up because he knows after this, there's just two more rounds that he needs to work out. So he's all charged up. 45 seconds of Dead Box currently underway. We're done. 10 seconds now. We have 35 seconds remaining. Let's go, people. Please leave your feedbacks about our routine, our workouts how effective they are if they're helping you out on the RCB Instagram, YouTube, Twitter handle pages and give us your honest feedback and of what you think of this routine. Let's go, 30 seconds up, 15 more to go. We urge each and every one of you to stay fit during this time so we can get fit before New Year. And with that, we have a break. Let's go! Lying down, torso rotation. And here I am counting his reps while Mr. Gajanbhai is swiping left. Keep going. 10 seconds up. 15 seconds up. Now Magamba's got a hang of it. Very nice. 20 seconds up. Nice, 25 seconds up buddy. 20 more seconds to go. That's it, nice and easy. 15 more seconds. Brilliant. 10 more seconds. In five, four, three, two, one. Break. Before we move on to wheel holes to end round number three. In eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Let's go, buddy. V holds. V holds starting now. If you cannot do V holds, you can do seated brace holds. Or there are multiple names for it. This is what we call it. All right, just hold it. Breathe in, breathe out. Do not forget to breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Keep going. 25 seconds done. 20 more to go. 30 seconds done. 15 more to go. Don't stop, buddy. Don't stop. Nice. Even Gadanbhai is working out. We see him doing this in front of the camera. He looks very cute when doing that. In two, one, break. All right, welcome back to round number four of Steady. Dead box coming right up in three, two, one, go. Keep going. Breathe in and breathe out. Mr. Suraj Mani in the house. Keep going. 10 seconds up, 35 seconds more to go. That's it, keep going, keep going, keep going. Twenty seconds up. Twenty-five more to go. If you cannot keep your arms raised up, it's fine. Get onto the mummy position and just work your legs. All right, that's perfectly fine. No need to worry. No need to feel bad. Scale down versions are still good in my books. In four, three, two, one, break. Fifteen seconds later, we're gonna get into the lying torso rotation. In nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Nice one, buddy. Keep going. That's it. Keep going, buddy. Fifteen seconds up.
30 seconds up. In five, four, three, two, and break. Fifteen seconds break. We move on to V holds to close round number four of steady. In three, two, one. And I bet this is a sound that he hates because he knows he has to go to work. Let's go. Come on, buddy. V holds, man. V holds. Come on, one last time. Can we do 20 seconds of V holds and 25 seconds of your normal scale down version? Because you remember you made me do 15 seconds of plyo spiders. Huh? All right, that's 20 seconds up. Let's go. 25 seconds more of regular. B holds, feet grounded on the floor, breathe in, breathe out. Why aren't you talking to me? Are you mad at me or something? Let's go. No, no, no. Let's get up. Come on, come on. 15 more seconds, buddy. Fight this through. Come on, speak to me. How was your day? What do you have for lunch? What plans for the weekend? In five, four, three, two, one. Break. Round number five of steady. One last time, coming up. Let's go, buddy. Steady, buddy. Somehow my jokes are not clicking today. I need to go back and do my research or I should just stick to working out. 10 seconds up, buddy, come on. 15 seconds up. Twenty seconds up, twenty-five more to go. Keep going. Nice. Last twenty seconds, buddy. Twenty seconds. In nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and break. Fifteen second breather. And then we have lying down torso rotations. In nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and go. That's it, buddy. Keep going, keep going, keep going. That's it, nice. 15 seconds up. 20 seconds up, 25 more to go. Let's go, buddy. Five, four, three, two, one. Break. 15 second breather and one last exercise before we wrap up. Steady. Are you ready, my friend? Let's go in five, four, three, two, and go. That's it. Keep going, buddy. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Nice one, buddy. Thirty seconds up, fifteen more to go. One last time to end the steady round. In nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Rick, good job, buddy. Okay, it's time to explode with Phantom Boss.
All right, so uh, it's time for Fan Boss to explore out in the last bit of today's workout. Day six coming to an end. We've just got his five more minutes of workout. 15 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Two exercise, one minute around into five rounds. That's all we got. You gotta give it your best. You're gonna give you another 30 seconds of break. Quickly hydrate, no drinking on uh, water in between the rounds. All your energy goes into exploring out, doing the reps, right? 15 seconds it is, 15 seconds break after that. So the first exercise is split, stance, punch, burpee. Split stance and punches and burpee. The next one, lateral shuffle. You gotta keep doing that as fast as you can. Three shuffles on your right, three on your left for 15 seconds. Five rounds. And we're gonna start off in 15 seconds, starting now. Keep it going. Five seconds up. Ten seconds up. And break. That's 15 seconds. Break coming up. Pace it out, guys. The whole round about explode is not giving all of it in round number one because we got a last five rounds. And three, two, one, and shuffle. The key is to sustain all the five rounds, guys. So pace it up well. Make sure you do not stop the entire five minute of round that we've got for you guys. Got another three more seconds and break. 15 seconds break. We move back to round number two with punch, burpee. Coming up in three, two, and let's go. Let's count his burpees today from this round. Two up. This is his third one. Let's go, fourth. We will definitely see a spike. That's his sixth. And break. All right, so he's done seven burpees in second round. We will move to lateral shuffle in five seconds. Let's count how this guy paces up his burpees. In three, two, one, and let's go. Side to side shuffle. Keep going, do not stop. Keep going as fast as you can. Five more seconds to go. And break. 15 seconds break and we move on to round number three. Seven burpee uh, that Chris has got in the previous round. Let's see how many he gets in round number three. The whole idea is to just beat by one and let's go. That's one, two, three, come on, four, five, six, seven, eight, and break. He got eight, so he's got his previous score beaten. We've got 15 seconds break coming up. And then we move to lateral shuffle, and that would be round number three coming to an end, right? We've got five more seconds. Three, two, one, and go. 15 seconds off. Side to side shuffle. Pace it up, guys. Pace it up. Make sure you do not empty out the tough rounds, the burpee rounds. Save it for the burpee and break. That's the end of round number three. We will move on to round number four. And we will come back to the burpee count of eight. That's the burpee count that he had for round number three. Three, two, one, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, then that's time. That's nine burpees, so he's got seven, eight, and nine, and we've got 15 seconds of break, and then we move to the side-to-side -side shuffle. And then we will go on with our last round for today. And we're gonna start in three, two, one, side-to-side side shuffle. 
for 15 seconds. Breathe, breathe in this round, guys. This is your recovery exercise. The burpee was your all-out one. So breathe, 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 and break. One last round for day six coming up in 15 seconds. Split stance, punch burpee. Right, we're gonna start off in three, two, one, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and nine points. All right, so that's the end of the burpee count. We've got one last exercise which is gonna start off in another 10 seconds, but we got 9.5, we still better than nine. So I think we improved in every round. Lateral shuffle in three, two, and go. Just breathe guys, this is your recovery round. We've done our best in the burpee. We've got crazy amount of burpees today. Approximately around 35 to 40 burpees with punching and break. That's the end of today's workout. That is day six coming to an end. It was a mad amount of workout. Phantom Boss is still, as usual, gasping for his breath because he does the explode round. So I'll have to say goodbye on behalf of Phantom Boss as well. See you all tomorrow, day seven. We have a great workout lined up for you guys. Hope you had a good workout today. If you've missed any of the workouts, what you gotta do is just make sure, go back to the old videos and start pulling those videos out and complete the exercises. Do not leave a single video out. The whole idea is that we complete the 21 day series together, right? Do not miss out on any videos. See you all tomorrow. Coach Mogambo and Fan Boss signing off. This is Bolus Fit, fitting farewell to the year 2020. Wow, 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 wow.